going on, everybody? Thank you for tuning in to another edition of On the Road to Victory. I'm your host, Jimmy Smith, and I hope you're all having yourselves a great start to your Friday. It has been one hell of a long day for me. Went out there, destroyed my ankle, my neck, but got some work done outside. I am completely destroyed, though, and uh, ready for some Fan Friday live tonight around 9, 930. But before that, we've got ourselves a little bit of Eagles news, so going to drop that on you real quick here. And uh, look, any thoughts, any questions, anything you have you want to add to this, love to hear from you in the comments down below. Appreciate you hitting that like button, subscribing, all the things you're doing to support the channel. Cannot thank you enough. But the Eagles added an offensive lineman to their practice squad. And Tyer Phillips here, former New York Giant, former Baltimore Raven, Let's get to know him a little bit here. So, 26 years old and, you know, 344. That He's got like 30 pounds on the Raven Clark. Both of them are 6'5", but four years younger. Um, look, I don't know what the corresponding move is because they haven't uh, announced it yet, but if you go to their site, you'll see that the Raven Clark is not listed on the practice squad. So, just uh, guessing that they went with the younger guy here. He was let go from the Giants there on their practice squad. So this will be his fourth year out of Mississippi State. He was a third-round pick back in 2020 by the Baltimore Ravens. And, you know, he has definitely had his struggles. He's had his injuries, just missed the preseason here. So, again, this is a practice squad. I know people will get worked up about it. This guy's not coming here to start. He is not depth on the offensive line on game days. He is literally on the practice squad. If anything were to happen, you hope that this dude learns the system, gets better, stays healthy, all those things. But he's on the practice squad. So he has started 18 games out of 34. In that time, these are offensive snaps here, 1,172. But he's given up 10 sacks. I think he has nine, I believe it was, uh, false start penalties. So not so great, man. A very short career, <laughs> giving up a lot of sacks. I think that's even more than Raven Clark, who's played for like seven years. So... Uh, I mean, you got to look at the snaps, how many they played. But, you know, this kid, he was a third-round pick. They had high hopes for him there in Baltimore. He only lasted two years. Then he went to New York last year, was waived, then cut off of the practice squad, and well, now he is on the Eagles practice squad. So, speaking of that practice squad, give you an updated look at that real quick before I head on out. But, again, love to hear your thoughts on this. The practice squad, I know some people – upset we didn't get another punter this that look they're working people out we uh, talked about the three tryouts uh, we had yesterday and when they find a guy they will add them but if not you'll elevate a certain someone uh, if you need to but let's take a look at this practice squad here uh, on offense you've got four wide receivers and uh, look love what we've got there mr dependable greg ward Britton covey the punt returner devin allen had that one nice kick return if he doesn't fumble that, maybe he takes it for a touchdown, but maybe he can continue during practice to work on that. Joseph Nada, big-bodied wide receiver. Love to see him, you know, continue to grow, learn from A.J. Brown. Um, bright future for that young man. I had a tough preseason, but a good camp. So we'll see what becomes of him. But then you've got three offensive linemen, Toth, Good Jones. And again, it hasn't been announced that it was a Raven Clark, but he's not on uh, that um list there on the practice squad Eagles roster. So if you go online, you'll see what I mean. But uh, Toth, Good Jones, look to still be here. And then we have tight end Brady Russell. Then you have seven guys on the all, or the defense here. And I got some numbers here for you. Do not fear Tyre Phillips. Um, don't have his yet. But I did get Thomas Booker's and uh, Tijuana Mullen here. So you see Thomas Booker rocking 59, 33 for Mullen there. But you've got an interior defensive lineman in Thomas Booker. Then you've got a couple of edge rushers in Teron Jackson and Kyron Johnson. And then you've got a couple corners, Makai Gardner, Tijuana Mullen, and then one linebacker, one safety. So Van Sumer and Tristan McCollum, both freak athletes, love their athleticism. So hope to see these young men grow on this practice squad. And I'll keep you up to date with all this stuff. But if you're doing the math at home, you know that was only 15. So here's your 16th. And look, you need to have someone that can hold for Jake Elliott. You need someone that can punt during practice, all those things. So right now he is here. And, you know, again, they're going to try to find someone. We know that he is not good. So 
We just got to stay patient here, believe in Howie, Nick Sirianni, all these guys, Michael Clay, uh, to figure out what punter we need here. But until then, you know, you've got Sippos here. If you need to elevate him for game days a few games before you find someone, okay, whatever it needs to be. But let's get on the ball there. But nothing to complain about for me. And uh, here is the full list if you would like to see it that way. But there are 16, so it is full there. And you've got, uh, again, you have those eight guys on offense, seven on defense, and one special teamer there. But love to hear your thoughts on this, how you feel about Phillips, how you feel about the practice squad, whatever is on your mind. That's all I've got for you right now. But as I mentioned, I will be back later live tonight for Fan Friday. Looking forward to it. Oh, my God. Only one more of those. And football is right in front of us. Oh, my God. <laughs> Nine days away. Can you believe it? Been loving the comments. The countdown. We're finally in the single digits. Remember when it began in 99. Oh, my Lord. So let's go, baby. Eagles football is almost here. Hope you're excited. Hope you're having a great start to your weekend. But until next time, I am Jimmy Smith. And this is On the Road to Victory. You all have a great weekend. Stay safe out there. And as always, say it with me now. Go Birds!